All right, ready for another adventure here, uh, going to Caddo Lake. Should be super duper awesome. The uh, car is completely packed now. So, since we're doing a little bit of car camping, uh, packed a bunch of cool stuff again. I'm gonna do a through hike at some point here, but it just seems to be car camping every time because of the places that I go. But it's gonna be awesome because we're going to Caddo Lake. Uh, then me and Luke are gonna go to two separate spots ourselves. Uh, super duper awesome. Just need to get the uh, kayaks on the car. Uh, my sister has the straps in her car, so we're gonna head over there, get the straps, and then I'm gonna get ready. Uh, Luke is inside, uh, just chilling, getting ready to go. Uh, so it should be fun. West Texas, Caddo Lake, about a four hour drive from here, but it's gonna be awesome, so. Peace. Okay, so we've gotten a lot closer, like 15 minutes away from the lake. Very long car ride, like four hours, uh, but it's been super duper sick. Uh, we stopped here to get some cool pictures with my boy Smokey over here. And uh, now we are headed out of here. All right, so we made it to the park. It has this uh, really cool picnic -y area. That I'm checking out right now. I uh, figured I would stop here, let Luke play on these swings. Uh, surprisingly, really big swings, so I might even get on them myself. Right, but um, oh okay, but no, it's super awesome. This park is amazing. I've never seen anything like this. Just beautiful Texas. Looks like there's some grills over here and a few little picnic areas. Um, unfortunately right now, really hard to even get to this place for day use just because of everything going on right now. They only have a certain amount of capacity. So make sure you go online to get your reservations online before you go to the park. Um, and if you call, um, just expect your, you know, you're not gonna be able to get the reservation over the phone. Um, it's kind of frustrating right now, I totally understand. Uh, but if you go ahead of time, uh, always book uh, the week before, too. Because uh, if it's like, say, Thursday and you're trying to get in here Friday or Saturday, it's going to be booked like every park. I'm talking even parks that I've been to that uh, typically are really easy to get in and out of. As far as getting reservations, they're completely booked. So um, some of the really nice parks like Caddo or the more popular ones, I'm definitely expected to be a while. Plus, everybody got kicked out of their reservations um, in the middle of spring break. Uh, when they shut the parks down so reopening they're trying to get those people have priority to you know reset the reservations and and you know you don't so uh that's my two cents uh i think i think i'm gonna swings right now and uh check this out these look pretty tall so all right made it to the lake area pretty awesome uh, i can definitely see that oh cool oh i got awesome looking moss really has that real eastern
scenery around here is absolutely awesome. See a ton of squirrels going crazy. Uh, I cannot wait to get to the campsite. This is just a dock area. I had to check this out first. Um, eventually I will get to the campsite. We've been here for about two and a half hours now and I still have not looked at even our campsite, but I will um, just keep meeting really cool people uh, that are fishing. They kind of let Luke fish for a minute and uh, he has his reel and rod, but uh, no hook on it. So he's just having fun casting it out. I do not know how far this goes. So I think I'm gonna hit this. Definitely looks like a trail, so I'll probably hit it up a little bit later today or tomorrow. Pretty eager to get on the water though, so that's probably what I'll be doing once we get our tent set up. Okay, finally made it to the campsite. The campsites are awesome, they're super cool. Um, the wood is actually provided, which is really cool. Uh, you just kind of donate some cash, uh, drop them 10 bucks, figure we're gonna be here for two or three days. Um, so also, you know, don't collect wood because you definitely don't want to affect the decaying wood around here and the ecology. Um, we kind of drove around. There's some killer showers, uh, total full service, full shower, full everything. Um, screen cabins are good, but this is just this view from your campsite, like there, this fire pit. This is gonna be awesome. Yep, we finally got here. I'm eager to get set up and uh, get the uh, kayaks out there with me and Luke and go check out some stuff. This scenery, never seen anything like this before. And it's only about three hours away from DFW area, so totally worth it. Okay, finally got everything set up and feeling pretty good about that. I think there's a little bit of daylight left, so time to hit the water. I'm telling you, I am just dumbfounded at how beautiful this is. This is so awesome. If you haven't had a chance uh, to get out here, uh, I would strongly suggest doing it. This is unreal, y'all. It's so unreal. Like this green. It's leaves. These green leaves uh, that's covering. I'm sure that it's an invasive species. It's kind of not necessarily good for the area. It looks really, really beautiful. Uh, so I guess just uh, clean your boats, right, when you get out. And uh, make sure you dry them off. So you don't spread anything, especially in areas where there are invasive species. Hey, but uh, this uh, this scenery is just I want to crazy. To look at the camera. Oh. I want to look at the camera. <laughs> the camera. Okay. Well. I'm gonna um, eat the camera. As always, and I always like doing this stuff with Luke because he's my little my little guy. Drop and, it! Drop uh, it! Please. Hopefully, encourages y'all to uh, get as excited about taking little ones out into nature because they really love it. Um, really kind of shapes uh, their understanding. Oh, some gunky water on me. 
um, of, of appreciating nature. So, um, Cattle Lake's awesome. I'm gonna put some footage of the hiking trail tomorrow. It's probably all I do for the night, um, but super awesome. Okay, I know I said I was signing off, but this sunset is crazy. Yeah, it's still crazy when I do this. Uh, just cutting through them trees. Just cutting through them trees. Whoa, it's like a fan. Are you gonna roll, roll your boat? Get me down the street. Mary, Mary, Mary. Down the street.